May Bell. Uh, yes, Miss Joyce. Uh, let me get that for you, Miss Joyce. Now, when that young doctor comes in for his breakfast this morning, I want you to tell John not to cook his eggs too soft. He likes them crispy around the corners. Uh, yes, Miss Joyce. Boy, I can't wait to go to Washington, D.C. <laughs> well, still, I will miss you. Well, May, you are one of the best girls ever. Well, it's not settled yet. I'm still waiting on a recommendation letter from Mr. Nixon. Boy, I hope he writes it. He will. I just want to get away from all the violence. Tell me, what's the latest on that? They found her other husband with his throat cut too, in a bathtub. No, Maybell, that is horrible. Mm -hmm. I wonder what these colored boys want in this section of the store. If you knew her as I did, you'd understand. Her husband, Hatcher, was a brutal jealous. Beat her every single time a man laid eyes on her. And then she had him killed. Mm, not yet. Then she met Walter Jenkins. No, then she went to the movies. What movie? The movie she got the idea from. You mean to tell me she got the idea to murder her husband from a movie? Mm-hmm. Don't they know they're in the wrong section? What movie? The postman always rings twice. Is it still playing? <laughs> Why, Miss <laughs> Joyce, you got somebody in mind? <laughs> we, we want some coffee, please. I'm sorry, we don't serve Negroes here. The snack bar is down there. Uh, let me take care of them, Miss Joyce. How you doing? Nah, I'm just the salad girl. Miss Joyce is the waitress, but she ain't gonna serve you here. So, uh, why don't you come over to the snack bar with me and um, you can take some food out. Do you buy things in this store? Yes, I buy all my things here. Do you ever buy food, say a sandwich, from the sandwich girl? Yes, we girls eat our lunch with Miss Joyce. And where does Miss Joyce eat? Where does she eat? Why, she eats right where you're sitting now. When you buy your sandwich, you can't sit with Miss Joyce and eat it. You have to take your sandwich to the snack bar, away from them. Now, nah, sister, that don't make sense. We want to be served right here. This must be some kind of joke. Now, this is why I'm leaving for DC. Breaking the law is just making it bad for the rest of us. No, sister. We're going to break the law. It's going to make it good for all of us. You'll see. We're going to do it right here in Greensboro, too. Right here, right now. <laughs> 